Today, I will demonstrate how to integrate an inline Modbus remote I.O. station from Phoenix Contact into Niagara using an ILC 2050BI as a master. Please note, this driver is only functional with our Modbus I.O. platform. Here you can see how the two devices are connected via an Ethernet cable. Make sure you have configured both devices to be in the same local area network prior to this video. To set up the bus coupler, please see the tutorial video below. To get started, make sure you have N4 Niagara Workbench set up, as well as the drivers for the ILC 2050BI. These add-ons can be found under the download section on the product page of the ILC 2050BI. Open Niagara Workbench and open a connection to the platform. First step will be to ensure the proper drivers are installed in the controller to interface with the Modbus Remote I.O. system. Click on Software Manager and search for Emolytics BK-RT driver. Click Install and it will add all the necessary dependencies. Hit OK and Commit. After a few seconds, the modules will be installed in the controller for use. Open a connection to the station of the controller connected to the Modbus I.O. Navigate to the driver's portion under Config. In the Driver Manager, click the New button at the bottom and select Modbus TCP Network from the drop-down menu. Click OK, then click OK again to confirm the new driver. Double-click the newly made Modbus TCP network driver to enter its database. This database is where Modbus devices are added to enable communication. Click the New button at the bottom and make sure Type to Add is Modbus TCP BK device and starting address is 255 and hit OK. In this next dialog, Set the IP address to what you set the inline Modbus I.O. station to 192.168.254.113 on my application and hit OK. Now click on the points icon under the extensions column and change the view to Modbus BK Point Manager and click the Discover button. You should now see the I.O. connected to the Modbus device. If you do not, Try re-enabling plug and play, rebooting the Modbus remote station, and disabling it again. You can import the points and use them in your logic within Niagara like any other point. Now you have integrated your inline Modbus remote station into Niagara and you are ready to control and monitor the I.O. If you like more information on this topic and other building automation related topics, please visit phoenixcontact.com slash Niagara.